No, no, see, I, I was about 19, busting tables right here. But, you know, the money wasn't shit, but uh, that wasn't the point. It was about being around the music, and I was. Let me take this one night. July 22nd, 1964. Who do you think walks to that door? My baby. Miles Davis. That's right. In the flesh. That's right. I'm talking about through those doors, the coolest man on the planet. Jeez. Anyway, he had been a recording session up at Columbia, uh, up on Vine. So, Miles comes to that door. Before you know it, he's up on the bandstand, jamming with the band. It had to be. Oh, <laughs> it was scary. I mean, the dude was so focused, man. But plus, he was kind of a scary cat anyway. Huh? I mean, everybody in the mama knew that you don't just come up and talk to Miles Davis. I mean, he, he may have looked like he was chilling, but he was absorbed. I mean, this, this one young, hip couple went up and tried to shake his hand one day. And the guy says, uh, hi, well, my name is... Uh, I said, get the fuck out of my face, you jive motherfucker. Take your silly bitch with you. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> you know, that's yeah. that. That was Miles, man. That's the way he was when he was in his musical headspace. This. But did you get to talk to him? I'm better than that. No. I played for about 20 minutes. Unbelievable. How'd you do? <laughs> How'd you do? Well, you really ain't shit when you're playing next to Miles Davis. <laughs> but he, he carried my ass. <laughs> what did he say? He said one word. Cool. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. That meant good, but not ready. It meant look me up when you are. Did you? No. I got drafted and got into some other things, and uh, by the time I got back to music, the uh, season had passed. But you know, I was born in 1945, but that night was the moment of my conception, right here in this room. Cry's not here now. Been around jazz ain't the draw that it used to be. What a great story. Mm. I gotta tell the people in Kulakan and got the hand of that story. You know the folks in Kulakan and got the hand here. Right, so. I guess when I thought you were a cool guy. I'm a cool guy. Good job I contracted to do. Come on, listen. Give the dude a pass. I'm working here. No, yeah. listen. You don't want to sit up here talking about improvisation and everything like that. You like the guy. You like how he plays. Let's, let's just play a little jazz. Come on. Improvise. That's funny coming from you. <laughs> How's this? I'll ask a question. What question? Jazz question. You get it right. We roll. You disappear tonight. If I walk out of here tonight, I will go so far away it'll be just like I was dead. And one more thing. These people in their rep here, Felix, well, you tell them I'm sorry. You tell them I had to. They laid a grant of immunity on me. And I was compelled. It was either play ball or go back inside, and I'm not going back inside. Laid on me. Where did Miles learn music? I know everything there is to know about Miles. Then let's have it. Music school. You got it at music school, right? His father was a dentist. He's St. Louis. Invested in agriculture, made plenty of money. He sent Miles to Juilliard School of Music, New York, 1945. <laughs> Tripped out of Juilliard after listening to your track down Charlie Parker on 52nd Street and mentored him for the next three years.